Welcome to the CDR for E18. After watching this video, you will get important link and information for migration to Australia. Moreover, I will get some idea how to write a career episode as a requirement of Engineer Australia. Be 100% successful to migrate in Australia with permanent residential visa. Australia is a wonderful place to live and work, offers much to the migrants in every field aspect. If you are interested, you can go to Australia with the three easy steps. Welcome to the CDR for EA team. After watching this video, you will learn how to get a PR visa in Australia with three easy steps. This is a points-based skilled migration. Subclasses 189, 190 and 489, Visa. For details, please click on the video. Do you want to know how to calculate the point for permanent visa for Australia? Please click on the video. Welcome to the CDR for EA team. After watching this video, you will learn how to calculate the pass mark from the point test for getting a PR visa in Australia. Before applying for the visa, your point should meet the minimum score of the Department of Immigration and Citizenship of Australia. Do you want to know how to write a CPD and CV? For details, please click on the video. Dear friends, CDR stands for Competency Demonstration Reports, which are originally technical reports that evaluating the education and competency level of overseas engineers. This is essential to the engineers, who want to work and live in Australia through migration. A Competency Demonstration Report is required, for assessing the competency of an engineer, who has overseas qualifications, and not covered by the Washington Accord. After watching this video, you will learn how to write a CV and CPD as the requirement of Engineer Australia. Do you want to know how to choose a project for career episode? For details, please click on the video. Dear friends, CDR stands for Competency Demonstration Reports which are originally technical reports that evaluating the education and competency level of overseas engineers. This is essential for the engineers who want to work and live in Australia through migration. A competency demonstration report is required for assessing the competency of an engineer who has overseas qualifications and not covered by the Washington Accord. After watching this video, you will learn how to choose a suitable topics for your career episodes. If want to know how to write a career episode, please watch our previous video. Let's start. Writing your three career episodes. A career episode is an account of your engineering education and slash or work experience. After watching this video, you will learn how to write your own CDR competency demonstration report. Let's start. Career episode format. Each career episode should follow the format below. A. Introduction, approximately 100 words. This introduces the reader to the career episode and should include such things as 1. The chronology, the dates and duration of the career episode. 2. The geographical location where the experience was gained. 3. The name of the organization. 4. The title of the position occupied by you. B. Background, 200 to 500 words. This sets the scene, and provides the context in which you have been studying slash working. It should include such things as 1. The nature of the overall engineering project 2. The objectives of the project 3. The nature of your particular work area 4. A chart of the organizational structure highlighting your position, in relation to the career episode 5. A statement of your duties provide an official duty statement where available. C. Personal engineering activity, 500 to 1000 words. 
This is the body of the narrative, and the key accessible component. In this section, you must describe in detail the actual work performed by you. You should state, what you did, and then describe how you did it. It is not sufficient to describe the activities performed, by a team or group, your own role must be clearly identified. Remember, it is your own personal engineering competencies, that are being assessed. This section should include such things as 1. How you applied your engineering knowledge and skills 2. The tasks delegated to you, and how you went about accomplishing them 3. Any particular technical difficulties slash problems you encountered, and how you solved them 4. Strategies devised by you including any original, or creative design work, how you worked with other team members D. Summary 50 to 100 words. This section sums up your impressions of the engineering activity, and your role in it. It should include such things as 1. Your view of the overall project. 2. How the project fared in meeting the goals slash requirements. 3. How your personal role contributed to the project. If you have still confused about the writing procedure of CDR, you can contact CDR for EA team. The primary objective of the CDR for EA team to help the engineer, who doesn't have enough time to write their own CDR moreover, it help the engineer, who feel difficulty in writing their CDR. Specialized 100% Satisfaction Specific writers for all engineering discipline Deliver on time Deliver for affordable prices Provide the perfect content, whatever the engineering field is Provide the totally unique content, thus this organization is the best in providing the CDR. Below is a short list of the majors, that we are able to provide the competency demonstration reports, or CDR for Australia. CDR for electrical and electronic engineering, including the, control, power, electronics, and communication. CDR for civil engineering. CDR for mechanical engineering. CDR for instrumentation CDR for industrial engineering CDR for textile engineering We are the registered company of Bangladesh Our license number 01931 and license ID 16-017-01931 We do assist engineers with their CDR preparation, based on wide experience, deep understanding of engineering practice, and knowledge of the engineers Australia requirements. The success of 99% of our clients, with passing their assessment, after using our assistance clearly demonstrates, that our services are highly effective and beneficial for applicants. If you are interested in any of our services, please get in contact with us. Our website address is http cdrforeawebly Thank you for watching this video.